all staying healthy and safe thank you all so very much for supporting my channel if you haven't already subscribed please consider subscribing to my channel also if this video helps you please consider giving it a thumbs up today I'll be discussing about how to calculate mean median mode and standard deviation in Excel mean median mode and standard deviations are part of descriptive statistics mean median and mode are called measures of central tendency and standard deviation is called measures of variability in column B C and D I have data for heights for three different classrooms so for example these 10 data values are student heights for classroom one in order to calculate mean for these values what i'll do is i'll type in equals then type in average and then open braces select the range of values and close braces and hit enter and then in order to calculate mean for these two this one and this one what i'll do is i'll just go ahead and drag uh, value in B13 to C13 and D13. Now these two are automatically calculated. You can verify it by checking the formula here. C3 to C12 is the range. D3 to D12 is the range for column D. Now we have mean calculated for all three uh, height data. For median, what I'll do is type in equals and then type in median open braces I'll go ahead and select the range close braces hit enter and then drag the values similarly for mode I'll type in mode select the data close braces hit enter and then drag the values and for standard deviation I'll type in equals and type in STDDVA. Why I'm selecting STDVA is because, uh, for example, if we have a total classroom student uh, count is 100 and I'm only selecting 10 as a sample data, so STDVA helps to calculate standard deviation for that sample so that later on we can use that uh, for inferencing uh, values for the whole classroom so here i have selected b3 to b12 and i'll hit enter i'll go ahead and drag the value to c16 and b16 so that standard deviation is calculated for remaining columns as well so this is how you can calculate mean median mode and standard deviation in excel hope this video helps you all if this video helps you please consider subscribing to my channel as well as please consider giving it a thumbs up thank you all so very much y'all have a good day bye bye